New at 11, we are looking into what happened at three Suffolk churches this week. Police invested, investigated two attempted break-ins, and at one house of worship, a suspect got in through a window. Ten of your side's Liz Palka is live outside the police department now. So, Liz, what else have you learned about this? Well, first, Nicole, police do not think all these incidents are connected. The churches are fairly far apart here in the city, making this more of a coincidence. But at one Suffolk church, someone did break in in broad daylight, leaving a senior pastor questioning security. This is the view from within Bishop A.S. Hall's office the last few days. They must have bashed it in. Paul is the senior pastor at Baum of Gilead Missionary Baptist Church in Suffolk. And his church, located off rural White Marsh Road, is the last place he ever thought a criminal would target. Crime is everywhere, you know. Um, whoever did it drove to do it, you know, intentionally. A church member checked on the property Monday around 4 in the afternoon. 45 minutes later, they got a call that someone had broke in. Hall and others checked the whole church. Nothing was taken. He believes the alarm set off by a motion detector in his office scared the suspect away. Had we not had that here, they would have had all day and all night to do whatever they wanted to do. But this isn't the first time Bomb of Gilead has been targeted. A week ago, Hall discovered someone had been tampering with the locks on three of his back doors. Another door that is, looks the same. He admits he didn't report the incident with the doors to police, and he doesn't know if the same person broke in through the church window. But he does hope whoever is doing this will find another way to get by. We have nothing in the heart against them, you know, just um, sincerely praying for them because they have a problem. And Hall is now beefing up security at his church after this incident. Meanwhile, police are still investigating the break-in. Live in Suffolk, I'm Liz Palka, 10 on your side.